Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Uh, if you're new here, my name is Jonathan. Um, this channel is all about savings, promotions, discounts, um, on and off. I'll do uh, a DIY, DIY here and there, uh, some somewhat installations, uh, somewhat unboxing, and a little bit of review. Uh, and if that is something that you're into, then you're, you've come to the right place. And uh, just uh, sit back and enjoy uh, today's episode of the laptop uh, Acer from Walmart. This is only for uh, $3.99. And if you haven't checked my uh, previous video about the Acer desktop, uh, I'll list it somewhere up there on the screen and uh, feel free to do so. Okay. Uh, but in this uh, video, we're going to be looking at this Acer's laptop here. And I'm going to go over some of the spec that he has. And I'll give you my opinion to see whether it's worth it for, uh, for you to buy it. Uh, this one, the regular price, it's uh, $449. And now you can get it for $399. Um, the savings about $50 there. Uh, this one, will, it will come with the 15.6. Um, uh, inch screen full HD and uh, the latest generation of uh, Intel Core i5 and it will come with 8 gigabyte of DDR4 RAMs and for the hard drive is 256 gigabyte NVMe SD and it does come with Windows 10 okay and let's take a look some of the pictures here so it looks like it does have a webcam but um just like any uh, laptops out there, even with the high-end ones like uh, the Dell uh, XPS, the latest model, or the even the MacBook Pro, the uh, resolutions for the for the laptop has been only up to 720, which is terrible. Okay, terrible, terrible. But uh, hopefully, with the newer model, they will upgrade it. But just like any model, this one most likely will be 720 as well. Um, in my other video, I do have uh, a video that sh that shows you how to use your uh, old DSLR as your uh, webcam. So you might want to check that out, or you can even use your uh, iPhone to use that as a as a webcam as, as well. So, but going back to this one, so this one is let's see, it's not bad for four hundred dollars because right now a lot of uh, our students are or not our students, our kids are home studying. So if they need a budget laptop. Uh, you know this might be it rather than using one of the Chromebooks uh, that's provided here there we go the keyboard is not backlit okay that's the side right there HDMI uh, Ethernet port um, headphone jack mm, the other side That's the top view. That's pretty much it. Okay, so um, let's go down and take a look at what else. These are just some comparable uh, laptop that you might be interested. In, but I think for the money, I think this one is a uh, is a better choice. This is the 2020 model, um, and here is a little bit more of the. Uh, the spec itself, okay, which we already went over, and here, Intel Core Tension. Let's go down to some of the review and see what customers, what people are saying about this laptop, and then that way, it'll give you a better uh, decisions. You know whether this laptop is for you or it's not. So this one, it doesn't state when it was in, but um, it gave uh, five stars. Amazing mid-range laptop. My husband works in IT software, so I had him play around with this and test it out and then let me know. He said below, high qual uh, quality fabric sleeve protecting the laptop in the, in the box. 10 generations i5 uh, processor touchpad is nice and responsive just for clarification it is not a touch screen good mid-range hardware the screen is is nice and bright and not washed out 
The processor is pretty fast. App uh, open nice and quick. Battery is iffy. You could probably get about three hours of battery. Keyboard is nice and responsive. It's a great mid-range laptop for just clarification. This is definitely not a gaming laptop. Works great for schooling, work, typing, paper, and etc. I love how fast it is opening apps. Okay. And then we have another, the opposite one, a negative one. And this one gave it a one star and it says, uh, don't buy this. And all it said, it just moves slow, doesn't want to turn on, and it's brand new. So it doesn't give us uh, much more information. But uh, here, this is uh, pretty much it. Five stars, amazing mid-range. Going down again, this is August 20th. This is uh, five stars again. And you can, I'll, I'll list everything uh, in the description so that way you can uh, read it yourself. But uh, as far as the review goes, uh, you can see that majority, you are getting a mid-range um, laptop. So, you know, don't expect some kind of high-end gaming and all kind of touchscreen stuff like that. Because uh, if that's something that you're looking for, then you should check out Dell XPS. Uh, 13 inch and 15 inch as well, and as well as the 17 inch that have recently come out and those ranging from at least close to a thousand to two thousand okay uh, but for this one for four hundred dollars I think it's 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 a pretty good deal okay so again the majority is five stars we're gonna go down a little bit more and see here it says the does how many ports does it have VGA optical reader SD slot so it says here, the answer is no optical drive, one HDMI port, and no card reader. Uh, I think we go, let's go to the back over here because I think this is more critical. This is something that um, a lot of uh, people wanting to know. Is there another slot to add more RAMs if needed? Um, and he, it says there is one slot that has four gigabyte but can be removed to put in up to 16 gigabyte for a max of total 20 gigabyte. Um, system memory so this version has 8 gigabyte RAM not 4 I think it can be upgraded to 12 so uh, the information is there I don't know how much is true so this version is come with 8 so if you add another 16 gigabyte to it so that would make 24 okay so and does it have an SD card slot uh, no uh, does this laptop have a backlit keyboard? Uh, the answer is no. Okay. So that's pretty much it for this laptop. It's a uh, budget uh, laptop. So it, it will probably get the work done with the, the newest one, 2020 out there. So for $400 full HD, uh, uh, the, for the hard drive is NVMe, which is really fast, you know, and comes with Windows, uh, Windows 10. So not bad at all so if you guys have any questions um, let me know but uh, other than that take care and uh, I'll see you guys in the next video